Hello there. What is happening? Lads and ladies, I'm going on an adventure this weekend in Georgian. A lot of you might have seen this week, we got a new Scania 660 truck. It was at Balmoral Show and a few people were asking if Georgiana is still about and she is. So I'm heading that off and that. The show is still on, new trucks at the show, donkeys at the show. So I'm off to England to Winder's Dino Day. Um, the people are, are friends with Donkey and he's sending me over because he's busy. So I am bringing the 1455 and, and my pickup because um, I'm hoping to do a bit of filming and get out on the road uh, after the Dino Day as well next week and do a bit of filming. So I have a boat to catch in a couple hours. I need to wash the truck, wash the trailer, wash the pickup wash the tractor and check it for oil and stuff as well um a few bits the screen's very dark 1455 is kind of like the go-to dino day tractor really oh yeah looks fine they were saying down my way if the dipstick is wet there's loads so that'll do yeah she's badly needing a wash now um, probably a drop of diesel, it'd be, it'd be fairly embarrassing now if I ran out of diesel on the dyno. Oh, look at that straight pipe. Has to come off to get the bonnet up. Oh. Um, check her for water. That's full now. Oh no, she is, she is. She'll be fine, as the fella said. I say she should be out right for back end oil. She's not leaking because she was parked over in the shed on clean concrete and there was nothing, <coughs> nothing underneath her. So I'd say the back end oil will be fine. It's not like she's going to be doing road work anyway, just over to this man's yard and sit in a dyno. Um, what a rig though, what a rig. <sighs> yeah, right, I better get washing, fun. tied down hopefully you've just seen a time lapse of me washing and loading and all that crack that that was the plan i don't know i don't do time lapses i'm not sure if i set the cameras up properly or not but ready to rock now anyway um don't know if i'll get much more like vloggy footage while i'm getting on the boat renting but i'll try anyway um yeah <laughs> there and jack up the air in the trailer and the back of the unit it's very low and she might get caught in the ramp it uh it wouldn't be my first time catching that trailer on the ground now or my second time actually so i said i'd jack it up just to be safe
Just got pulled over by the Vosa. Not great now. Not great. I'm on the road again. I'm a bad old singer, aren't I? <laughs> I no real bother with the Vos anyway. Um, they were just pulling in everything back there into that place. Um, I'd changed one ratchet strap that was holding down the, the pickup. It was kind of frayed and he was like, oh look, if you have a better one there, will you throw it on? And um, check my check the taco and my card and driver's hours and all, but obviously, I was out in Australia and New Zealand for four months there. I haven't done 10 hours driving in the last six months. So there was no issues there. Um, so yeah, it was handy enough. It's grand. Um, a funny story for you though. Well, it's not funny at all, really. Um, I haven't a clue where I'm going. Donkey didn't send me a pin. He didn't give me a phone number. He didn't give me nothing. So I'm just heading for the vague part of England that I know this thing is on at. But after that, I haven't a clue. And he's a Balmoral, so I can't. Well, he's probably finished now. I'll make it on to him there later on. I know I'm here, alright. Look at that, look at that for service, huh? I'll tell you, if I was 10 years older. <laughs> 10? <laughs> you don't say more than 10. <laughs> what have you got for me? Well, I told you I wanted bacon. Oh, yeah, or the whole shebang. Sauce. And cake. Oh, all for me, the whole lot? That's all for you. My God, huh? You won't be able to get rid of me. Paul, the day is done. Finally, day is done. It's all over. We Are you made happy? it. All over the moon. Over the moon. Couldn't, couldn't expect anything better. So what? What was it in the end? Sixty-one tractors. Six. Ah, uh, sixty-one tractors in the end. Uh, a couple of zetters as well to keep me happy. Oh, there's a couple of zetters. <laughs> there was a right mix today, to be fair. There was a bit of effort, to be fair. Uh, I think the biggest was a Massey. 286 horsepower or something. 286, I think it was. 7260 yeah. or 7726 or something Can't just like mind that. what the numbers was, but yeah. Yeah. But anyway, tell us what was it all for? What was it all about? What was the charity? To raise money for JDRF, which is Juvenile Diabetes Research Fund. And, and this is, is close to your heart because? Because my eldest daughter, which is now 10, uh, was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes four years ago. Yeah. When she was six. So and that's an everyday that. struggle that for is you. an everyday it's everyday she's insulin dependent and yeah so it is it kicks us every day yeah, yeah. so we thought we'd raise some money set off to be a small little gathering and turn big <laughs> yeah you were saying originally it was like your <coughs> 40th <laughs> uh, around around this time and um, you were going to have a bit of a party and a bit of a get together and raise and some money and it yeah. It turned like there was a big crowd here today. There's a big crowd here today. Yeah. I we talked to Gareth a bit and bounced some ideas around and this is what we came up with. Yeah. We haven't there hasn't been dino days in this area. Yeah. Nobody's put one on. Um so we thought, right, if we get twenty or thirty tractors here, there'll be a bit of crack. Yeah. And look at us at sixty. And then like you had, it, it was a real family day out. It wasn't it just was. dino. So uh, the other Aye. shed was packed with, I don't even know what was in there. There was. Aye, so the other sheds was full with kids games and everything. 
just the real good the sunshine helped yeah there was someone selling tractor the models and truck models and it's a coffee and, yeah, place yeah everything and so yeah no we just you had the raffle had the raffle there was uh, an auction later on as well there was an auction at 10 o'clock tonight um, uh, with all sorts of lots from loads of straw to weekends away to uh, it sounds like all uh, big stuff for the, uh, for the auction like. a day's crushing uh, so a day's hire for a man with a stone crusher to a man with a hayab to give you yeah, for a day's yeah, lifting yeah. to what else is there ah some slurry spreading <laughs> umbilical cord <laughs> slurry spreading something, something for everyone there's nearly something for everything um, so you got to you got to take the fourteen fifty five on the dyno. I got the baby. How did you get on? What's the I got the baby on it. I no, that's my baby. <laughs> Is she staying? Like I'm not allowed to bring it no, home. No, no, you're not allowed her to. You you brought it to this yard now. It's staying. <laughs> we'll maybe uh, we'll load you home with something else. Yeah, yeah. We hope Donkey doesn't notice. Aye. So she made one seven five. She made one seven five. No, I had her down at Bally Bay dyno day. Well, I suppose Morton had it down really and. She made one seven nine that day, so she's back a bit, but she's, she's probably a due a service. To be fair, ah, she was idle yeah. all the winter there, and yeah, she's I said the filters probably wouldn't go astray, but, but we can't complain. We can't complain. Like. It, it, I think a lot of people liked it. Yeah, oh, it, definitely. As soon as you started crowd. her up there earlier on, everyone turned their head. Yeah, yeah. To be fair, it like turned everybody's head, and yeah, people just really do love that old girl yeah and it, then there was a tract tractor there that was I, I didn't think i'd see one of them here tonight no <laughs> track tractor there there's a field marshal oh yeah this this field marshal this here. one here yeah what was she was she like 40 horsepower no or she got 12. oh okay oh it must have been the the tract one got 40. the tract one yeah, yeah, got yeah, 40. Yeah. i think she i she managed 12. yeah she was under pressure too but then <laughs> didn't expect to get stuff like that for the day yeah, like, yeah that's yeah. that was the real thing we had everything from new tractors mm. to older stuff very real crack. Old everybody stuff. seemed to enjoy the crack from morning till night yeah 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 it didn't seem five minutes ago it was six o'clock this morning <laughs> yeah you had a busy day a uh, bit just, of sunburn there as well I, I'd say. yeah it's just been a bit it's been a bit <laughs> hot today it has a small but i was uh i was trying to hide in the shade but sure look Maybe I go, uh, no, I'd say I'm no, all right with the old cap on there all day, like, you yeah, know. Yeah. But uh, no, fair, look, you got a brilliant day first. We did. The we weather did. was unreal. It's a lovely part of the country as well. It is. I was never it around is. here before, but I flew I, with the drone there earlier on things, and I was this is a lovely spot around here. It is a lovely spot. It and is. Uh, yeah, look, it's all for a good cause. That's it's all what's good all for about. God. We were delighted to be involved. For, you know, thanks for inviting us. Nah, no, and, uh, no. Gareth's been a good friend now yeah. for many years through the shows. Just met him, happened to meet him at shows, and he's been a hand. Obviously, he's been at events like this. He knows the do's and the don'ts. And, yeah, and yeah. So sure, he would have told. Like he had a good system there today. In one way, out the out other way. way. That was that was him. For yeah, that yeah, was yeah. the one thing. The one piece of advice he did give us was: yes, make sure you've got good flow. Yeah. Don't get everybody <laughs> stuck. Because at one point today, that yard was full. Uh, but uh, look, in fairness, you got going early. A lot of these things, uh, they start at ten o'clock, aye. and it turns into one o'clock, and nothing, not. not aye. Then there's 50 oaks sitting in the yard waiting. Yeah. Whereas you started at 10. We were, I uh, were way before 10 this morning. And there was maybe 10 yokes sitting in the yard, and I, then the, they were going through as the ones were coming in, and yeah. that yeah. was the key to it. Was starting at the we right just, time. We wanted to get it started as soon as there was plenty of tractors here to really be worthwhile starting, get the start. And yeah, it just worked. As I say, we were hoping to be finished for the raffle for three o'clock. We had a few there afterwards, but yeah, no, yeah. happy enough, happy enough. Yeah, I think it was 40. Six, four, no, 54 gone through. There was 54 before gone the through before three the o'clock. raffle at 3 o'clock. And whatever, what's and whatever. seven left over then yeah. for afterwards. Right, so. Yeah. so, no, good um, day. And we didn't blow any up. Yeah, <laughs> always a bonus, I suppose. And then yourselves then, so you have your own truck. I have my own truck. That's the stage for tonight. That's the, yeah. And then you do the VMAX silos. I do the VMAX silos. So I bought the VMAX silos from County Monaghan and sell and distribute them all over the UK. And we also do second-hand hopper relocation. So if you're looking we, at the drone footage and you're wondering why there are so many I, spins <laughs> around the yard or yeah. scrap metal or whatever, like yeah. he's a good excuse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we keep bringing some silos in. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so that's your that's your business and a bit of farming, obviously. The farming as well, sheep, beef, and bed and breakfast <clears> pigs on the farm, and then yeah, we. So we're busy to start with without yeah. trying to. <laughs> not sure I've slept much this last few weeks, but. It's all worth it though. It's all worth it and we've had some great help from great friends. Yeah. That's yeah. what's helped us out. Right, Paul, look, thanks for having us over. No worries. Thanks for An coming. Anytime. Thanks for coming. It's some presence is that thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Lads, I'm gonna leave you with a compilation of footage from today and I'll try and 
get the horsepowers from the board and stick him in there and start a few arguments. Yes, there's going to be some arguments tonight. That <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Some man had his air con on and the other man wasn't at full revs and yeah, that's why yeah. he was less. And like me, like, oh yeah, I need a diesel filter. I, need to, yeah. I already come with the excuses. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah.
we've just come on tonight to let everybody know um, how much we raised on Windows Dino Day for JDRF, which is type 1 diabetes. Um, it was a phenomenal day and we've completely outreached our expectations of how much we were going to raise. So the current figure is 19,751 and 24 pence. So we are just 248.76 short of 20,000, which is a massive achievement uh, and would all like to say thank you so much for your support on the day. You're saying thank you? Thank you. Thank you. Ryan's gonna donate the rest of the cup for 20 grand. <laughs>